Let's take a look at how we can add and customize the numbering system in Microsoft Word 2019. So we see this particular paragraph, and let's say there's, uh, well, we see three sentences right here. And let's say we want to turn this into a numbered system rather than just having it show up as a paragraph. So what we can do is highlight the paragraph itself and then go up to the top. Now make sure you're on the Home tab in Word, and you can see the numbers. So all I have to do is click on Numbers, and you can see it numbers them based on the sentence that you see here. So it doesn't go by, by lines. It actually waits to the end of the sentence, and then it starts the next number, number two, at the beginning of the second sentence and does the same with the third. So that's really handy to have. Now let's go ahead and highlight this again, and let's hit the drop down, and we can choose any one of these other numbering library options. So let's go ahead and choose this one. And let's go ahead and choose ABC. So lots of different options here. Now, if we want, we can also do what's called changing the list level. So let's say that the second sentence needs to be sort of a subcategory of the first one. So all I got to do is highlight this second sentence, go up to numbering, and go to change list level. And then I can pick any one of these options. Let's just go ahead and choose the lowercase a. And there it is. Take a look at that. So it changed my C to a B here, and it changed my A, uh, my B into a lowercase a. So if I continue to uh, hit the drop down and change the different levels, then you can see all the different ways that it changes it as it goes down. So we can go all the way that direction as well. All right, so let's undo that and go back to our customization. And now what we're going to do is highlight this once again and hit the drop down. And from here, we're going to click on define a new number format. So we can see that a new customization comes up that says number style. So we hit the drop down and we can go and take a look at some of these different options. Let's choose first, second, and third, just like that. And we'll choose our alignment. We can choose it left, centered, or right. Left still makes the most sense. Let's go ahead and click OK. And look at that. Now it says first, second, and third. If we hit the drop down, we see that new option just shows up. There it is. Let's go back into customization again and choose the define new number format. And we can change the font. Let's say we don't like that font. Let's say we want to do italic and we want to do uh, Arial. So I'll go ahead and click OK and OK. And look at that. So it doesn't change the text here. It just changes on our numbering section. So I also like you can right click and uh, choose options as well. So we can see continue numbering, set numbering values. So if we don't want you know, first, second, third, we go first, fifth, tenth, for instance. Uh, we can also go to font again, and we could say, let's make it larger. Easier to see. There you go. So there's all the different options. Now if we select this once again, and we go back to numbering. Let's say, oh, we don't want to spell that out that way. Let's just go back to one, two, three. And you can see it keeps the same size font. So if you don't like that, you can right click again, go back to font, and you could make it uh, to go back to smaller or whatever size you want at that time. So lots of customization options in numbering in Microsoft Word 2019.